Today we're at our offices in Laval, Maison Creative. It is such an exciting day. We're doing the book launch party for our book, Play for Profit, the correlation between sports and business. And obviously my co-author, Mathieu Dubuc, is here. How are you, Chris? I am great, brother. Are you excited? Yeah. Let's have some fun. Let's go. Do it like at the at the maximum he can do, and he's just gonna put his 200% every time. J'ai toujours pensé que Mathieu écrirait un livre parce que c'est un garçon brillant, c'est un garçon plein d'énergie, et il a toujours plein d'idées. Il a réussi, il a réussi à faire ça et il travaille fort et je suis très fier comme son père. Chris usually achieves what he sets out to do, so am I surprised that he wrote a book? No. I'm not surprised he wrote a book, it's just like impressive. He's dyslexic and I feel like words are his enemy, How? but he just pulls it off and he writes a book. Force de persévération, euh, de persévérance plutôt. Euh, il a réussi et puis j'en suis euh, très fier pour lui. Euh, je, suis, je suis nullement surpris que Mathieu ait écrit un livre. J'ai l'impression que chaque fois que je le vois, il a toujours un nouveau projet. La surprise, ça a été d'apprendre hein, qu'il a écrit un livre et que ça fait cinq ans qu'il écrit un livre. C'est aujourd'hui que je l'apprends. Donc, euh... <rire> félicitations et continue dans, dans tes futurs projets. Ben, je suis très fier de la réalisation de Mathieu. Euh, C'est un, 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 un garçon qui, depuis qu'il depuis qu est au monde, a toujours eu plein de, de projets. Et euh, je suis euh, ben, très fier d'être son père et, et euh, je suis épaté de ses réalisations et, et je suis sûr qu'il va continuer de me surprendre. All right, guys, I'm just going to ask for five seconds. And when I'm saying five seconds, you guys know I'm a speaker. It's not going to be five seconds, so I hope you're comfortable. 40 minutes, no, I'm not saying it's going to be 40 minutes. I'm going to have to charge him at that point. We just wanted to take a few seconds to say, first and foremost, thank you very much for coming here. It warms up our heart for all of us to see you guys here. Many of you uh, may know Chris, and if you don't know him, that's, that's how he is, right? <laughs> I don't know if that's good or bad. That's, that's, no, that's good. So if we talk about the, the book, at one point, I see this guy come in the gym with that kind of energy, not wearing a suit, but it, he might as would have been wearing a suit in his, in his head, right? And he comes in very uh, hyper in a morning class where most of people need their coffee. He's already like ready to, to rage. And uh, I'm like, ooh, who's this guy with high energy? And at one point we talk and we realize we like to read books which is not a high energy thing, right? You have to be still and actually read the book, which impresses me that he does that. And it impresses him that I do that also. Naively, we're like, we should write a book together. He's understating it. For people who don't know him, he's an actual athlete, this man, like legit. And for everyone else who knows him, he destroys us in every single workout, so it's kind of annoying too. But anyways, keep going. <laughs> She's pretty good too. <laughs> yeah, 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 Julie. You guys, come, Julie, wait six seconds. Vous n'aurez jamais pensé, regarde comment elle est petite, c'est la personne la plus en shape ici, là. OK, tu peux retourner. Sorry, Julie. So if we could impact together, I'm like, what kind of lives can we change? And that's why we started this book in itself. And as he mentioned, very naively, we're like, ah, oh, it's going to take a couple of months, maybe a year at tops. How long has it been we're on this book project? Five years. This is a five-year project, guys. We're slow. So wait, 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 bro, don't think we're slow. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> but it depends. As a coach, I'm very much aware to know and not to do is really not to know. To learn and not to do is really not to learn. That's a quote from Stephen R. Covey. So we wanted to put actual stepping stones of what we're teaching you, you guys could actually implement it. So I 
urge you guys, if you're picking up the book, which we truly appreciate, start doing the steps. There's mindset steps, there's physical steps, and let's see how it's going to impact your lives and beyond. And we like to say that it takes a, a village to raise a kid. Us, it took a city to write the book. <laughs> So we definitely needed someone to help us to tell us where the letter B goes and the P goes and, and some sort of orders of words in the sentence, right? Um, I'm definitely the same there. And someone to edit also so all our ectic thoughts sometimes come into a smooth package, right? So Gregory Kaladian has been that editor and coach and it would have definitely not happened without him. And inside the book, I don't know if you can find, we actually, instead of just using stock images, used an illustrator to have images and illustrations that actually summarize exactly what you're about to learn in the chapter. And Patrick Marcoux has been the one doing every single illustration and Trust me, if you know Chris, he had to redo them many, many times to make sure that the dot is in the right spot. So he had a lot of patience, so we'd like to thank him for that. But he's been working with me for years, bro, so we're good. <laughs> and obviously, I'd like to, to thank Chris because even though if he, he looks like a crazy person like this, he's definitely the organization behind the book. Not only did he obviously write it with me, but he organized every single meeting, making sure at the end of the meeting, everyone knew what he had to do and making sure we would plan the next meeting so it doesn't fall through the tracks, right? So, so through the cracks. So thank you very much, Chris, for that. I appreciate that, brother. <laughs> and I know, Matt, I, I'm speaking for both of us. We have the same sentiment. Thank you guys for being here, supporting us from every audacious things that we do together. So I truly appreciate you guys for being here. And finally, Matt, I would like to thank you. I respect you so much as a man, as a father. I thank you for all the examples that you've given me. And I know that there's a lot of people that have that same sentiment that come into your uh, CrossFit gym and you help us get in shape. So I truly appreciate you, brother, from the bottom of my heart, man. I love you. No, I never thought Christopher would write a book. But then again, I thought Christopher could do anything because he was so enthusiastic about life. Ouais, je suis très enthousiaste à l'idée de lire le livre. Je suis sûr que je vais apprendre plein de choses. J'aime le sport, j'aime les affaires. Et là, grâce au bouquin, je pense que je vais avoir plein de tips qui vont me permettre justement de joindre les deux et d'être encore plus performant. I just want to know, because I look at your food and I know it's so much passion. Where did you get your passion for food? Because I love what I'm doing. I love my job. <laughs> if you guys need a caterer, I mean, Here you go. Here you go. Here you go. Shijano. Flexing his guns here, and I'm flexing my suit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm passionate about like scratching, beat juggling, DJ battling, and uh, yeah, there's uh, there's no ceiling to this. It's just learning every day and uh, getting better and practicing and uh, staying hungry. You know. I you know? love that. Des entrepreneurs comme toi, avec la passion du monde, qui ont la hame, qui voient plus loin que le bout de leur nez, d'aller chercher cette passion là, puis de le driver avec un écosystème où ce que tout le monde peut s'entraider. Parce que justement, on fait vibrer l'entrepreneuriat puis la passion dans le monde. Bro, I'm not gonna lie, I am drained right now. I'd rather give a speech for five hours non-stop. Signing books was great, but it was draining with my dysgraphia, dyslexia. It was definitely challenging. Bro, how did you find this event? We did it. We did it. Real talk. This whole time I was thinking about that, I was we were writing like a thousand books, and we're like, yo, we did it. I think the event was beyond uh, what we could have. Uh... Imagine, expect, or imagine. We gotta, we gotta work our hands, man. Like I'm a bit sore. <laughs> <laughs> I was legit climbing up as well. Everybody that was here, everybody that wanted to be here that couldn't be here, we just want to thank you guys for being here and just supporting our project. Please buy it on Amazon. Let us know if you guys want to sign copy. Give five star reviews. Check it out and let us know what you guys think. And Matt. And please, please also, actually. 
right, the little challenges, mindsets, the sport challenges, and if you want, get in contact with us and let us know, tag us, we'll give you some tips, and we'll definitely enjoy watching your, this is only the beginning, and we hope to change the world where people understand that movement is not a waste of time, it's not just for kids, it's actually a huge investment in your business. Let's go, we'll see you in the next one. Can I scratch something real quick? Can I like set something up? Bro, if speaking doesn't work out for me or coaching. Okay. Yeah. Okay, just leave it up. Yeah. <laughs>